Hello everybody and welcome back to Killer Gaming. My name is VSDA. Now, uh, I'm not really concerned with you seeing my uh, face to a point, at least for now, but whatever. I can't move it up there. Anyway, this is um, <clears throat> a tutorial on how to connect your PC to your TV. Now, if you're like me, you pretty much went and um, looked at about 10 videos at this shit. And I, I was getting very frustrated and didn't understand, what, why, am I ha why do I have to look at 10 different videos to find out one particular thing? Maybe someone uses that VGI port thing, or, you know, I'm only using a HDMI port, by the way, in this tutorial, just to let you know. <clears throat> now, it sounds simple enough. Uh, you've got a PS4, Xbox One, or even a Blu-ray player, and you plug it in to a HDMI port, to your TV, to your whatever, and it's, it's so simple, it works. That's all well and good, that's pretty much what I expected. <sighs> now, to the untrained eye, I feel kind of stupid for finding this out, because it's like, you know, god damn, but whatever, it's not a problem, because um, I'm, I'm, I'm very much a noob, so it uh, pretty much surprises even myself that I'm doing a tutorial uh, on this subject, but anyway. So let's go down to the PC, specifically, and I just want to explain something to you. There's a few things here, a bonus thing as well. Okay, so first off, this is the Vibox, and... Um, it's called the Barracuda, specifically. They named it the Barracuda, which is actually a fish. Jesus Christ, I don't know why. And it, I googled it, whatever. Anyway, uh, the name of the case is Tactician, by the way, if you're interested in buying it and what have you. Uh, you know, I might put the link in the description below. Now, I've covered it with a towel. Now, this is for when I'm not playing the, the actual PC, and this is to prevent dust. If you, you know, of course, when I am going to be playing it, I'm going to take this off uh, to uh, let it cool down and let all the air vents, you know, get all the air necessary to it. Anyway. This wire at the back, uh, specifically, is for the HDMI ports at the front, I've been told. And I, I, I originally thought it went into a monitor. I don't have a monitor right now, so I have to use my TV. And uh, so I thought uh, this would have to be right close, because look, this, this, this wire ain't doing nothing. It's so short, it's ridiculous. Apparently it pops into one of these blue ports here, uh, whichever one, I'm not too sure, and the HDMI ports at the front should work. So that's just a bonus, okay? That's just how I'm telling you, uh, just in case you've got a wire and you don't know what it is. I mean, that's what this wire is before, specifically. Anyway, <clears throat> onto the HDMI. Now, I plug my HDMI in. I see HDMI port in, and I plug it in straight away. And it gave me nothing. It wasn't working. Anyway, <clears throat> after a lot of uh, searching around, and it's again, I found the answer, and it's so stupid, it's unreal. Um, basically, this comes with a number of HDMI ports. Now, depending on if you've got a graphics card or not, now, if, like most people, I'm sure, if you're smart, you'll get a graphics card with your PC. Uh, this is the 960. But because there's a bunch of default graphics cards, I mean, default uh, HDMI ports on the PC, uh, they are usable. You can use these HDMI ports. However, if you have a graphics card, like most of us do, I'm sure, it renders those ones useless. So essentially what I was doing is seeing a HDMI port and plugging it in up here. If I can just get plug it in. Yep, it goes in this one. Okay, now it's being a bitch. Whatever. Yeah, there you are. Anyway, so I was plugging it in and it was giving me nothing. Anyway, didn't really look at the back uh, and all the rest of it like I should have. And you'll see down here. <laughs> you'll see down here are a bunch of ports here and essentially one of these, this one I believe is the HDMI port is a HDMI port anyway so now now I've got that plugged in I'm gonna turn, turn you guys okay and if I can just now you can see my TV a little bit Okay, I'm going to plug this, I plugged it in, I'm going to turn my PC on, that's it booting up, and there you go, that is my, it is now, uh, the ASRock motherboard is now connecting to um, my TV and my PC, uh, I haven't set it up of course because I have not got my keyboard out and everything, there will be a, an unboxing video on that uh, coming up, um, so I cannot wait to show you that in the next few weeks. But that, it's that simple, guys. If you have a HDMI, if you have an HDMI cable, plug it in. If it doesn't work, you've got a graphics card. Try other HDMI ports. Look about uh, on your PC and try each one of them, depending if you've got a graphics card or not. So, but yeah, it's essentially just about trying them all. Um, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to this video. And I hope this helps. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.